We gather today to receive the gifts of God, and we gather in the name that was pronounced over us at our baptisms. We gather in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. If we say we have no sin, we deceive ourselves, and the truth is not in us. But if we confess our sins, God, who is faithful and just, will forgive our sins and cleanse us from all unrighteousness. Let's take a few moments to do just that. Most merciful God, we confess that we are by nature sinful and unclean. We have sinned against you in thought, word, and deed, by what we have done and by what we have left undone. We have not loved you with our whole heart. We have not loved our neighbors as ourselves. We justly deserve your present and eternal punishment. For the sake of your Son, Jesus Christ, have mercy on us. Forgive us, renew us, and lead us so that we may delight in your will and walk in your ways to the glory of your holy name. Amen. Almighty God in his mercy has given his son to die for you and for his sake forgives you all your sins. As a called and ordained servant of Christ and by his authority, I therefore forgive you all your sins in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The Lord be with you. And also with you. Lift up your hearts. We lift them to the Lord. Let us give to the Lord our God. It is time to give Him thanks and praise. It is truly good, right, and salutary that we should at all times and in all places give thanks to you, Holy Lord. betrayed took bread and when he had given thanks he broke it and gave it to them saying take and eat this is my body which is given to you do this in remembrance of me in the same way also after supper he took the cup and when he had given thanks he gave it to them saying drink of it all of you this cup is the New Testament in my blood which is shed for you for the forgiveness of all your sins. Do this as often as you drink of it in remembrance of me. Let's pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Take and eat. This is the true body of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, given unto death for you. Take and drink. This is the true blood of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, shed for you for the forgiveness of all your sins. Having received this body and blood of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, now go in peace, confident that your sins are forgiven, reconciled with God. Amen. participating in our communion service, there's one last thing I'd like to say, and that's this. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you his peace. Amen. Christ is risen. He is risen indeed. Alleluia.